Hello everybody, it's Vegetarian here, and welcome back to Terraria. In the last episode, we battled a bunch of Queen Slimes. Unfortunately, we couldn't fight the Dreadnoughtless. So in this episode, first we're going to do a little bit of little bit of inventory management. Not inventory management, per se. We're going to be trying to upgrade some stuff. So we're going to go over here. I'm going to buy the Mini Shark and the Illegal Gun parts from you. We're going to come up here, and we're going to use some of these accessories that we got. And we're going to make the Armor Bracing and the Plan... That's two ang shield accessories down. Also off screen, I did an angler quest and I got the hotline fishing hook. Now, before 1.4, this was the only way that you could do lava fishing by using the hotline fishing hook. I'm replacing our blood butcher, not our blood butcher, what's it called? The chum caster, right? Yeah, I'm replacing our chum caster because that's 30. This is 45% fishing power. Now, I'm going to be completely honest. I don't really have a direction for this episode to go. I mean, we don't have any more bloody tears. So we can't battle anymore. We can't do any more blood moons unless one spawns naturally. We can do a pirate invasion though. Which honestly, I, I might do. You know, we get the discount card, the lucky coin, bunch of goodies. We can fight the old one's army. Yeah, let's do that too. This episode is going to be a little bit uh, like all over the place, but... We're, we'll, we'll make it work. So I don't really want to waste my holy arrow, so I'm gonna just gonna use the endless quiver. We have our lightning aura rod, and let's go fight the old one's army again to kick off the episode. Here we are. There are a lot of werewolves around here. Just get get rid of them. Get out of here. All of you will be gone because I'm summoning the old one's army. Here we go. Fades one. Y'all y'all already know how it is. Let's see how the dayless storm bow fares. I also flattened out this area a little bit more, because what I want to do is with those lava bucks that I have, I just want to put some lava on the floor. What? Oh, that stupid werewolf! It's, it messed up my crystal! Oh, that's not nice. Messed my whole crystal. And this is my last crystal. I don't have another one. Okay, uh, yeah, bad news. The Daedalus Stormbow without the holy arrows, just the normal arrows. It isn't working out that well. Not gonna lie. Hey, back. All of you, anchor. Anchor. Okay, anchor's not working. Uh, we just have to re rely on the shield dash and the Daedalus Stormbow. Put another one over here. Also, we have the unicorn, so this should help. So we got the bombers. Yeah, I'm gonna just, just run around with the unicorn and use the Daedalus Stormbow. Wave two down. How's our crystal looking? How's our crystal looking? Wave three is here. Just drop some more Daedalus Stormbow. We should be good for over here on the right side. We said I have three of the little traps. Over here, I only have two. So we're going to have to focus more of our attention on the left side. But that's better than focusing our, all our attention on both sides. Okay, never mind. They're not dying. All right, you guys are getting real close. We completed the wave. But still, you guys got to gotta back up. Back all the way up. We got a Defender Metal. I don't see any stragglers. We have 30 more mana. Let's put one here. You know, let's put another one over here. And then put the last one on the other side. All right now we have the wyverns. They should be easier to catch since we have the Daedalus Stormbow. It still does not mean they're not annoying. When my boy the Dark Mage shows up, that's going to be a completely different ballgame. I'm already a little handicapped because that stupid werewolf d decided to come in and mess up my crystal as soon as the event started. Wave is complete, making sure nobody else pulls up. Yep, see? Right there. I would have missed them. Our Dark Mage is spawned. Yep, Dark Mage is spawned on this side. Uh, gotta make sure there's no Wyverns nearby. Alright, none over here. So we just gotta get rid of the Dark Mage. Shouldn't be that hard. Alright, he's gone. That's it. Another, another Gato Egg, which is nice. But we complete the Old One's Army once again. We got 30 defender medals. Never mind. 33 defender medals. So before we fight the pirates, let's just see what the angler has for us. Underground caverns. Okay. Easy peasy. Alright, angler, what you got for us? Crate potions. I don't need crate. I don't need to do crate fishing right now. I need the bottomless bucket of water. So I checked the wiki. It didn't say anything about like the flying dutchman not being able to spawn unless you fight a boss. So, we're gonna try it again, and maybe we can find this time. Here we go, here come the pirates. I might kill a lot of my people by doing this, but we all have to make sacrifices. Probably put the yo-yo back on, actually. 
Uh, we're not gonna be using the Shield of Cthulhu all that much. So we're gonna use the yo-yo. And wait for the static. Yo, nurse, you better get inside. These pirates are about to show up. Thank you. Let's close the doors, penguins. You can stay in here if you want. Here come the pirates. What? D dang, they already murked one of the penguins? Nurse, you might want to get to higher ground. They already busted open the door. Nurse is just chilling, though. She hasn't gotten hit yet. Oh! The cutlass! Oh, shoot, a pirate captain already. But we already got a cutlass. That's a weapon I wanted. How much did that parrot just take from me? How much damage? Ah, oh, they're killing all my people. Actually fight- Oh my gosh. Actually fighting the pirates is definitely a It's definitely a lot more difficult than just hiding. Where, where'd the pirate- There's a pirate captain down there. Where'd he go? Did he despawn? Watch out. It's those crossbowers. I see the pirate captain. Yeah, but those crossbowers, they're the ones who will try and snipe you. Ooh, 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 pair, 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 pair. I saw bullets. I saw bullets. The bullets almost got me. So, so are these pairs. These pairs are coming awfully close. What? Cannonball? What? What a cannonball? Man, I need to call up the straw hats. They need to come deal with this. No flying Dutchman yet. No, no, like outstanding drops. Stupid parrots, man. They're so fast and aggressive. Oh! Never mind. Here's here comes the flying Dutchman. Okay, we're gonna go inside. I don't have my dash. That's why. I was trying to dash. We got an Amarok again. I don't really care. But what, what? What? Parrot! A parrot killed me. Alright, this is starting to become a graveyard biome. Uh, I'm not really trying to have that. So, we gotta remove some of these gravestones. Go, 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 go. I wanna... Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Try to stay inside so the Dutchman can't get me. And we're just gonna fire the Daedalus Stormbow from here. A little bit more. And the Flying Dutchman has fallen. He dropped nothing. Well, here comes another one. I kind of want to get rid of that Pirate Captain down there first. I want to see if he has anything good. Yeah, I just summoned a spider right on the cannon. So the spider's going to take it out for me. Yo, where'd the pirate captain go? Did he run away? I don't think he died. Because then the, the ghost would come after me. The pirates have been defeated. They're all running away. But I can't let them leave just yet. Ah, oh, damn, they're leaving. Okay, as long as I don't let the flying Dutchman get away. I can still fight that, at least. All the pirates are dead. Now I just gotta deal with the flying Dutchman. And our look, our spiders was doing work. Oh my gosh. They the Dutchman spawning more pirates. And the Dutchman is gone. No more pirates will spawn. Oh jeez. We just gotta get rid of these guys down here. And that'll be the end of that. I see another cutlass on the floor. We got two cutlasses from that. And an Amrock, but otherwise, nothing else. It's 61 melee damage. But our anchor's a hundred, so we can't really use it. Now, I'm gonna be cutting this one a little short, but that's all the time I have for this episode. So if you enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell to get notified whenever I upload. See so ya, yeah, that's all. Bye, guys.